Hello adventurers! I'm back again and I hope you guys are excited for this video. It's Vlogmas Day 8 and this video was pre-recorded. I pre-recorded it around late September, early October I would say. Um, it's kind of a special video just because it's a Disney World, not a Disney World, a Disney in-store haul. But it's kind of special because it's my last in-store haul, at least here in in my home, in my town in Florida. Because we no longer have a store anywhere near us. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And let's get on to the video. Hello everyone, I'm back again and today I have a shop Disney haul that is back from the middle of summer actually the not the middle of summer it was in June or May and it's a pretty big haul just because it there was a big sale happening and lo and behold to my knowledge that I just found out my my Disney store the last Disney store in Southwest Florida <laughs> that I did not, in Southwest Florida, that I did not even know was the last Disney store over here is they were closed in August. So I didn't even get a chance to go back and grab things like I wanted to. I just found out that they closed it. I was gonna call them cause I wanted to grab something and I go online and it says, Disney store closed. <laughs> uh, I'm just in shock. <laughs> so there is no Disney store within an hour of me. So I would have to go all over. I would have to drive two to three hours just to get to the closest Disney store near me. <laughs> Can you believe that? <laughs> I live in Florida. And there's no Disney store now anywhere near me. So I guess I'll be doing all my shopping online now. So there you go. A little tangent for you guys. A little specific. So if you guys ever decide to move to Southwest Florida, just know there's no Disney store close by. <laughs> so that's why I'm going to be unbagging this. I've actually had this in my room. The last few months and I have yet to do a video on it so I'm just gonna do a video on it now that way I can show you guys what I was what I got and that everything that I'm showing you everything was on sale or clearance yeah I would think it was on sale or clearance so I'm really excited to show you guys and take a look at this big bag ah can you believe this it's huge so let's get started because I have a feeling it's going to be a long video. The first thing I that I got, which was definitely on clearance, definitely on clearance, was some was this Disney Sleep Repeat Pillow that came out early spring, and I just there was only one of them. I would have gotten two, but there was only one of them, and it's actually very comfy. I'm going to put this away because this is the holiday times, and this is not a holiday pillow. So, this is going to be reserved for after the holidays, like in January or February. Um, I do love this pillow, not only because of the nice feel of it, but also because of these cute little sprinkly Disney shapes in here. There's like sprinkles and everything. I believe it was like a sprinkle candy avocado um, design or something. Well, not for this pillow, but I mean like the collection was like inspired by snacks or fruit, not snacks. By like you know ice cream and avocados and donuts actually I think this pillow was designed specific for donuts yeah it was donuts and avocados I'm sorry 
<laughs> donuts and avocados. You can see my memory is going really well. Um, so this was originally priced $29.95. It says this was on sale for $22.99, but I think I got it a little cheaper because it was in the clearance section. So I'm very happy. And I'm going to put this away because I would use it right now, but it's holiday time, so I'll have to wait till later to snuggle up with it. So the other things I got were I was able to find don't mind this being wrinkled I just wait a minute was the Disney Wisdom um, holder what do you call this the Disney Wisdom pennant pennant Ooh, it's very wrinkled because it's like I said been in a bag for months now and this was sold out for a long time a long time I'm really excited I'm gonna try to unwrinkle this as best as I can so I can put all my Disney wisdom pins on here and I think I can't find my completer pin I think it fell in my bag I hope I hope it fell in my bag yeah, so I have to search for my pin. If I find it before the end of the video, I'll show you guys. But this is a limited edition pennant pin, a um, pennant, and it was originally nineteen ninety five. I think I paid full price, but I'm not sure. I like I said, it's been a while, but I love this, and I can't wait to put all my wisdom wisdom pins on here. So there you go. And and the next thing that I got was on clearance. Oh, I found my receipt. Did I? Yes, I did. Ooh. Well, this is no longer of use. Oh well, trash it is. So the next thing that I got was this Mickey this um mickey like tote tote not tote um this mickey um bag and the reason i got it was not only because it was on sale but also because i do travel to like new jersey i do travel to orlando i am planning to travel in a couple months nothing's a bit set in stone but i am going to be traveling to the other side of the coast Hopefully, if things go well. So, I thought I could use these for, like, my carry-on products. Like, my toothbrush, my toothpaste, you know, like, my jewelry, you know, my my cleansers and such. So, I have, there's, like, three of these little bags in here. And they're all, like, attached together. <laughs> so... You have this one back here that says avocado day good 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 day avocado and it has a Mickey Mickey, Mickey and Minnie on here their heads and this would be good to put like my um, my toothbrush or my toothpaste or like my hair bows and such and then I have this small one right here with that's designed with sprinkles and Mickey heads and this would be good for little things too and then I have this big one where I'm gonna put everything in and it's designed as Mickey donut heads and I love donuts so <laughs> they got me on that one I love donuts beyond anything so I'm really excited I got that that's gonna be good for traveling and it was on sale like the pillow because they came from the same collection then the next thing that I got oh I found the completer pin I have the wisdom it's kind of fun to do the impossible limited limited release pin and let me take it out of here so you guys can see it it's 
very beautiful. And it's going to look great on my pennant with all the rest of my pins. So at least I didn't lose that. <laughs> I would have been real mad. So the next thing that I got was also on clearance because they're trying to get rid of things was this case of pencils that were designed for the donut avocado collection and I do love pencils and I love the way they designed this was $9.99 and it's originally $12.95 there's a bunch and it's can you see on the bottom it's it's in the shape of Mickey look at the donut I love it I'm a loot. I'm weird. You can say it. Now the next thing I got was also on clearance. I like clearance products. So the next thing I got, which is ironic, because this month is the anniversary of the Little Mermaid movie coming out, which I'm going to do a special video on that one for you guys. And... <laughs> They had these flip-flops with the Little Mermaid from Javiana's and it's ready to make a splash. Well, that's what it says here. Ready to make a splash. And I just love them. I love them. And I, I'm going to start wearing these because I forgot I even had these. See what happens when you don't take all your stuff out? <laughs> trying not to make this video too long but I think it's gonna be then I have these let's see oh, oh yeah I had to grab these this is the donut <laughs> the donut coffee cup it's so beautiful and it's in my favorite color too, blue. <laughs> I love donuts. This is not going to be used for coffee or anything. This is just going to be used as like a holder or just for decorations. So <laughs> I love this so much. But I have to put this away because it's not donut time. It's holiday time. So I have to to, you know, put it away for a little while. And then I think I got another cup. <gasps> oh yes. I got this. This is the this is the Cinderella version of well not the Cinderella version. This is Gus right here with his trail of seeds or <laughs> food. And he's trying to get away with all his food before Lucifer comes after him. And inside it says Zoop Zoop. And it was on clearance for $8.99. This is also going to be used for decorations. And I want to make sure it doesn't break. And then the last thing that I got was actually something I prepaid for. Um, a couple weeks beforehand because when I went to Disney I had um, gone to the Disney shop for the Donald Duck key those, those keys that they give out and I saw that they had the Cinderella anniversary edition and not only that but they also gave you pictures like stills and you got like a little discount but the with the way things are changing they're not now they have like blu-ray now mostly everything's a blu-ray so I just decided to get the one with blu-ray DVD and digital code and I love Cinderella she's my favorite princess of all time and I just had to grab this that's the this is the excuse that I made to go get to get all to go to Disney shop this is the reason I spent so much money. Um, this is just... I love Cinderella, so... I know. 
this has been me nothing but talking. I'm exhausted from talking. I know. I'm not much of a talker, guys. And then I just paid for this bag. I'm exhausted from talking. I really am. But I am glad I was able to do this video and be able to show you guys what I got. Because... I am trying to catch up on all my videos. I really am. I'm getting close too. Very close. So I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And don't forget to leave me a comment. What was your favorite thing that I hauled today? Alright. Have a good one. Bye. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, before we go, we have to do our advent calendar. We have Olaf right here, and it's day eight. So where is day eight? Day eight is right over here by Olaf's foot, his little snow foot. And let's see what character is hiding behind the door. And the character hiding behind the door is actually Anna, who looks very much more mature than she did in her in the first Frozen. So, she's looking good. I, I'm loving the maturity of both characters. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want to see more videos, don't forget to subscribe and like. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.